There's only a couple collections that ever kind of like make your heart skip a beat, and this is like kind of like one of them for me. Ricardo Tisci, the most gothic and Catholic of designers, is also a real sports fan, which gives his latest collection for Givenchy a neat little twist. I like the acknowledgement of current events in the Winter Olympics theme of the alpine sweaters and the zippy sort of ski suit he touches. Yeah, I thought, I thought that was an interesting, actually, di digression for him. But they were still done in his sort of graphic quality, which I felt was a continuation of last season. It's a contrast between these big sort of hooded anoraks and then very delicate, you know, everything was yeah, very like, delicately constructed. The lace underneath the lace. that kind of big neoprene yeah. jacket. I've seen a little bit more colors than usually. They're those ski jumpers. They were interesting and quite sexy at the same time. Kind of almost feeling like a scuba diving suit versus skirt and kind of like the mini skirts going into trousers and stuff. An extreme sports element in Givenchy. For sure. We love Ricardo. It was we a fantastic show. We love the knitwear. Amazing. Man. We love the, of course, always feathers. and It was very modern, very chic. It was divine. It was divine. Beautiful. Better and better. I loved his new take on the this kind of geometric of asymmetry, which seemed somewhat symmetrical at the same time. It's just like a huge corner of velvet that was peeling over. It was beautiful. Master of cut. Very good cut. Very good silhouette. I think he's very talented. And uh, I think today, probably, is the best fashion designer. I love the softer element at the end, I thought it was fabulous, with Mary Carla in the sort of feathery outfits. There's a lot of stuff I would love to wear. There was a lot less Catholicism than usual, and I think the collection really benefited from that. You can never have too much Catholicism. <laughs>